Hey guys, today I will be doing the weekly reading for the sign of Libra. We're going to be taking a look to see what's going on with you guys and what messages Spirit has for you. Um, if this video resonates with you, I'd really appreciate it if you like, comment, share, and subscribe. That helps me out a lot. And this is a general collective reading, guys. It's not going to resonate with every single Libra. Please take what resonates and leave the rest. If you want insight on your personal situation, there's information in the description box on how to book a personal reading with me. All right, guys, so let's see what's going on. What do my Libras need to know? What do my Libras need to know? Hmm. You guys are going to be gaining some type of clarity about something, possibly about a um, an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy, or this is just somebody that's very, you guys are going to be either having a conversation with this person or getting some type of clarity about this person, speaking a truth to them, or they're going to be speaking some type of information to you that's going to give you the truth about a situation. Um, ugh, that bug's going to bother me. Ugh. Anyways. <laughs> Uh, yeah, but Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy, or just somebody that's very, um, successful, mature, grounded, nurturing. Mm. You guys may be speaking to somebody after somebody walked away or somebody ghosted somebody or abandoned. But I feel like somebody's having some type of awakening or is making some type of decision about a relationship here. I'm seeing something about equal give and take, harmony, fulfillment, happiness, an offer being manifested here or being extended here. But somebody may be walking away. Putting their guards up. Not wanting to be, you know, like emotional, emotionally vulnerable, possibly. Somebody possibly missing an opportunity and becoming single here because of some type of deception. Conflict is what I see here. All right, let's go ahead and take, take a deeper look with the um, tarot cards. Yeah, it's like you guys are gaining some type of clarity here that's going to give you the drive or the willpower to take action and to make a change in your life. Maybe starting on a new journey here, going in a new direction. Tell me more about that. Yeah, because I feel like you guys were feeling you somebody may have been manipulating you guys. Somebody was being deceptive. Mm. I feel like you guys may be seeing through that now. What's this? Page of Wands. Yeah, you're going to be receiving this type of communication possibly from an earth sign or this earth energy. About maybe starting something new or this is just communication. Maybe wanting to heal something that turned toxic here. Wanting to recover a situation. Tell me more about this. What's this communication about the devil in reverse? Seven of Wands. See, there's a Seven of Wands. Somebody's going to... Somebody may be trying to manipulate you and try to control you. Trying to come back towards you to try to, like, give you some type of... Sorry, guys. That bug is really bothering me, but... I feel like somebody is coming back 
they're defensive and they're going to be trying to be manipulative possibly what's the five of pentacles like they may be saying that they want something new with you but they're not going to give it to you somebody's feeling lonely somebody has not learned their lesson from the past here somebody's lost yeah somebody is something somebody's going to try to prevent something from ending because they're afraid of being alone that's what i'm getting here What's the awakening? Somebody is living in the past here. Somebody is being naive. Somebody is having unrealistic expectations of a situation. All right. There's a choice that needs to be made here. And I feel like somebody's going to try to prevent and an, 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 something that needs to end, they're going to try to prevent that from happening. Being manipulative. What's the two of cups? Three of pentacles. Yeah, somebody's going to want to, like, work together to try to come back into union here. But I don't know. I'm not feeling like re retreat after. It's going to be a failure. Yeah, it's not going to work out. What's the six of pentacles? Yeah. There could be something new coming towards you guys that's going to be um, reciprocal, though. Equal give and take here. Could be a new romance. It could be a new project. Project getting inspired by you know to do something here yeah four of wands commitment marriage stability celebrations a wedding family what's this ten of cups all right let's see yeah i wanted to come out reverse a smothering person mm. what does this have to do with the ten of cups nine of cups You guys could have somebody coming towards you. Could be a water energy here. Or maybe there's a need for you guys to heal. You guys may have like um, some insecurities that you need to heal from. Some addictions, codependencies, insecurities for sure. I see insecurities here twice. Maybe like a victim mindset, dependence on other people. That needs to be healed. And then once you do that, there's going to be some type of wish coming true for you. It's going to improve your health. You're going to be more emotionally stable here. Maybe there's somebody that you need to release that is insecure, a smothering person. I'm telling you, somebody's going to try to like manipulate you into not leaving you or, or like not leaving them. But you know what needs to end? Two of swords. Yeah, somebody is making it a, cho a choice here. Could it make the decision to offer something or to want to manifest something? What's this? Offer. Oh, that went so far away. <laughs> Hold on, guys. <laughs> the world, right? Exactly. <laughs> Somebody could not make a decision to end a cycle here. Because I feel like they had somebody manipulating them or making them feel bad, guilting them, playing the victim. That's that, that's that, um, that victim mindset somebody's gonna be playing the victim here to try to get you from closing out a cycle that you know needs to close out all right it's coming together now what's this eight of spirit saying you need to walk away what's this eight of cups nine of swords yeah you need to walk away from the situation that's causing you a lot of anxiety it's been traumatic it's a hopeless situation it's causing drama uh depression all right that did not do what i wanted to do all right there we go Page of Cups. Yeah, it's like you have new love manifesting for you. Hold on one second, guys. Hopefully, I don't mess up the video. All right. Um, yeah, you have something new, a surprise manifesting for you, but you have to walk away from this situation first. All right. Let's see. You need to rebel. It's like, Spirit's saying you need to rebel against this person. Do something that you've never, like, go against your truth, like, you're, you may need to do something that goes against your beliefs. Spirit saying. You may need to reconstruct your beliefs as well. Queen of Wands. Be confident. Have courage. Be determined. Yeah. I feel like you guys are manifesting somebody that's going to be very empathetic. Somebody that's going to be very balanced, understanding, loving, 
going to have a lot of love for you. They're going to be very attracted to you. All right. A good mom or dad, if that's something that you're looking into, you know, having children. All right. Yeah, you need to start saying no. You need to free yourself. All right, guys. So that's what I have here for you. Um, am I going to extend this reading? Mm, I think I will extend this reading. So if you're interested in that, um, the link will be in the description box. We're going to be doing some shadow work cards and some uh, trigger cards to see there, if there's anything that you guys need to work on um, to grow, to reach your highest good. Um, we also have self-love and self-affirmation cards. We're also going to be taking a deeper look at the situation with the situations oracle cards. Um, so if you're interested in that, the link to that will be in the description box. But if not, thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.